Well, looking ahead, staying on track during the holiday season can be a challenge for dieters everywhere. It really can. <laughs> KNWA Today is in Kirika Azuka joining us live in our kitchen. And in Kirika, how can we maintain our weight loss goals? Well, Lauren Tavares and Caitlin, so I don't know about you guys, but I know I'm definitely guilty of overeating during Thanksgiving. I mean, how can you not with all that delicious food in front of you? But I also know that I'm the one who's on the couch later with so much regret. And this morning, I have Candace Lee, who is a registered dietitian for the past 14 years, to talk a little bit about what we can do to stay in control and practice some self-control this year. So talk a little bit about, for me, I'm someone who I'll starve myself all day to have plenty of room for food. Talk a little bit about that. Yeah, so even on the holiday, I'd recommend that you'd go ahead and eat just a healthful breakfast and try to have a balanced meal going into Thanksgiving so that you're not overeating once you arrive. What are some other easy things that we can do to prevent overeating that I know a lot of people are guilty of? Yeah, during the holiday season, it's always good to practice mindful eating. So that can include waiting 20 to 30 minutes after you eat to go back for seconds to some of those favorite things that you really want. And it can also be, um, you know, offering to share a dessert with family or friends so that you get a little bit of everything, but you're not eating an entire piece at one time. So we actually have some options here. Like we can also replace some of our favorite with some lighter options. Talk a little bit about that. Yeah, so instead of the traditional heavy sweet potato casserole, we have here a roasted butternut squash with some Brussels sprouts that we snuck in there. And then we also have this light and festive appetizer that you could put out for your guests to graze on. So these are delicious. I actually tried these myself and they are delicious and we do have these recipes online. So talk a little bit about what can happen to our bodies when we overeat. Yeah, we can just start to feel sluggish and wore down and it also causes our body to work a lot harder than it needs to. It can cause problems with sleeping, digestion, all of those things. All right, well, thank you so much, Candace. So like I said, if you do want to maybe try something new for Thanksgiving this year, we do have these recipes on our website right now. That's nwahomepage.com. Tavares, Caitlin, I'll send it back to you. We're live from the kitchen in Kirikazuka, KNW Today, Northwest Arkansas News.